Training underway and the team taking the field against the Nationals later or earlier tonight. Our Chris Tavares, though, was at the game. He had a closer look at some of the players hoping to make a mark. Life in the minor leagues is a grind. Some days you wake up after a, a 14 hour bus ride just in time for uh, to get some lunch in you <laughs> before a game. And you're wondering, dang, is it really that worth it? But it's the hope of one day fulfilling a lifelong dream that helps players like Ryan Burke keep powering through. There's some t tough days that you're debating what you're doing, but uh, then you see the, the long picture, and uh, it, it just doesn't get much better than that. For Josh Rojas, he got his first taste of life in the majors when he was invited to the big league camp at the start of spring training before being sent back down to the minor league camp. It makes you work harder. Um, I mean, when you're that close, you just you want to double check everything. You want to work that much harder to to sure up some things. You know, you got to stay with it. You got to keep grinding. You got to keep playing. You got to wait for your opportunity. Sometimes you have to push your opportunity. It's a long road to get to the big leagues, um, and as hard as it feels to get here, it's probably harder to stay. That's a lesson that Brady Rogers has learned firsthand. He's been in the minors since 2012, save for five games in 2016 when he got his first taste of life in the show with Houston. And that day was uh, was special, not only for myself, but for my family, for them to, to see me grow up and to be able to, to accomplish my main goal. Uh, was was pretty special and uh, always gives me goosebumps every time I think about it. It's definitely a long road, but uh, but at the same time, you know, it's it's worth it in the end when you finally make it.